Hey guys, I'm Chess Pride. Welcome back to my Sims 4 The Occult Baby Challenge. This is part 18. And we are sitting here with our two boys, Mr. Potter and Mr. Ambrose. Uh, we have two towers currently, but I'm hoping that we will get this taller, Mr. Potter, aged up today, our little spellcaster baby. Um, and then we just aged Ambrose up last episode, so he's definitely not going to be aging up this episode. But we have three children in the house currently, and we need another one. So it's time to get pregnant again. And since Ambrose did not turn out being a vampire, even though his father is a vampire, we're going to have to try for a baby again. I think I'm going to stick with Caleb because Caleb's pretty cute. He has good genetics and he's a good vampire. So I feel like that's the one she would go for. So we're going to try that. The only problem with that is we, I think we have to go to him if we want to see him during the daytime. But he can't burn in the sun or anything because he is high up on the skill. He's not going to burn in the sun. He has sun resistance in the skill tree. So, uh, I think we'll be fine going and visiting him during the day as long as he answers. But for now, everyone is getting their hunger up. Both the toddlers are kind of hungry. They're all eating salad. A little clover here is, uh... Stretching, getting ready for school. He's so cute. He's so cute for a green sim. But it's his first day of high school. So I gotta get the picture of him going through the door. I'm gonna show you a notification we are going to send alone. Is we don't have time for that. And we are going off to school. Okay. So, I think everyone's needs are good. I'm not going to have him study hard. I normally I have them study hard, but he still needs to get a skill level 3, and he's pretty good. He's not low. He's like a middle average B student. He, he can work hard one time and get the grade up. So, I'm not going to make him work hard just because he doesn't have that skill level yet, and he'll come home less stressed out if I don't do that. Let's see, are you done eating? Uh, yes. Okay, let me throw this plate away. And I think we are going to go ahead and travel. I am going to bring the toddlers with me. So I want to make sure both of them have a tablet. You do not have a tablet. So I will give you this tablet. You have a tablet. Good, we can get our skills worked on. It'll all be good. Alright, we are at his house and look at our cute little boys just in their long sleeve. Where? Oh my gosh. They're too cute. They're too cute. Hey, but um, what is the skill you need to work on? You have like one skill you need to get up. It's thinking. Of course it is. It's always thinking that happens last. So I need to use your tablet. And, uh, we will play some shape to get thinking up. And you, you pretty much need everything, right? Yeah, you, you literally only have movement. You don't even have a smidge of potty. Oh, joy. Oh, joy. And well, why don't you work on thinking, too? Because that's what your brother's working on. You guys could be working on the same thing. That'd be real cute. Aww. I'm just chilling on their tablets. Okay, but for us, while the toddlers are entertained out in the middle of the street, no big deal, there's no cars in this world, um, we will knock on the door and see if Caleb is home. Pretty sure he is, but you know. Oh, there's Caleb. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Uh, reset. I need to, uh, Caleb. I need, I need, why does it not have the symbol next to it? Every time it does have the symbol next to it, it doesn't work. Let's see. Let's, okay, this one has the symbol next to it. Try for a baby with Caleb in the shower. Just real quick, Caleb. I need to get pregnant again. 
That would be great. All right. All right. So, how are we going to do it? Why are you guys just chatting? Can we try for baby with Caleb? Stop, stop talking and try for baby. Okay. Didn't even ask. Just went straight to it. Normally they ask. This is kind of bugging out. I'm concerned this is not going to work. But we're right next to the toilet. So, you know, we can get the t pregnancy test right away without wasting any time. Well, let me get this shot. Oh, yeah. We are trying for a, ba a vampire baby once again. Let's see. It it really, it really is the Halloween spirit to be trying for a baby with the vampire, I guess. So this is fitting. This whole series is kind of fitting for Halloween. Which is coming up soon. So, in real life at least. Alright. Come on. What is taking y'all so long? There we go. There we go. Fireworks are th there. Let's, uh, I just need to take a pregnancy test, please. Caleb, don't go anywhere. Okay, never mind. You just went somewhere. Oh, there's a baby crying. They have a baby. She is not pregnant. Dang it. Dang it. Why does this keep having me? All right, Caleb, who is this baby? Is this your or Lilith's baby? Why won't it tell me his name? More choices. I don't know. But let's, uh, that baby... That bed's gonna be hard to get to because there's a baby in it. So let's um, try for a baby in the bed. Okay. Just always taking care of the baby. Aww. See, maybe that gets Caleb in the mood to uh, try for babies having a baby. All right. Come on. Let's ask for this. All right. Are you asking this time? Maybe. No. We just got two thousand two hundred and seven dollars of book royalties, and now his sister's in here. Great, great. Let's try for a baby camp. Come on, come on. All right, all right. Come on. Weird. The woohoo's are being weird. Alright. Let's, uh, try for this again. Hopefully we're pregnant this time. And I'm hoping it's a vampire. It's the last one wasn't. And that's real annoying. Alright, let's, uh, take a pregnancy test. Come on. Alright. Come on, fast forward. And we are pregnant! Woohoo! Woohoo! We're trying for a baby again! What is this? Oh, failed to conceive. Alright, let's see. How is that skill coming, Potter? He is 37% complete. Not the best. But you're 48% complete, so that's alright. Lilith, leave my children alone. Leave my children alone. In fact, I think it's time we uh, head on home. All right, we are back home. We are pregnant. Thank goodness. Let's get a picture of that first trimester belly bump. But I think with Ambrose, we should probably work on potty skill while we have the time. I don't think he, he doesn't really have to go. Let's look at his potty and his attention up. So let's um potty help now. And let's see. Potter, where are you at? 
Yeah, you can use a quick potty break. And then we are going to play shapes on the nesting blocks and get that thinking skill up. So that'll be good. They're both a little hungry, but I think you can wait. Um, Potter needs some attention, but once he ages up, he can get attention really easily. And we just need him to get to level 3, and then we can age him up. Super exciting. Oh, look at her carrying him. Okay. We just got the communication skill. Fantastic. Get some potty help up in here. Some double potty training. Even though Potter already has his potty skill level 3, which is as high as you can get it. So it's not really training for him. It's just regular potty for him. See how quickly he did that? <laughs> he's a pro. He's a pro. I don't have to worry about it. Okay, but he's going to go play with nesting blocks. So we're going to do that. We're going to throw this plate away too. And then, um, Alex, when you're done, well, we might want to potty train him until he gets level 2. Let's see. Don't go play with the dolls. I want you to potty help again. Okay, we have a class presentation. Clover has to present in front of the class an entire class. He has some great ideas for how to jazz up his presentation, even if they're not exactly what the teacher asked for. Should he go out and make his presentation shine or do what's just asked? I feel like he would just do the minimum. Honestly, he's a jock. No offense, but he would do the minimum. <laughs> Let's see. It says... Why the present? What a nice presentation! How straightforward and expected, says the teacher. Clever er, earns a straightforward and expected gray as, and gains small performance. Fantastic! Okay, I think we're about to go pie train again as we did get it to 50%. Pretty good, 51%. So, yeah, he should. Be able to complete it next time. And when she's done pie training, I'll have her clean this. Um. Are you guys pie training? Okay, good. Pie training. But I need to check on the garden. Ooh, Patchy, you are falling behind. Oh, good. As soon as I say something, he starts on it. How convenient. How convenient. Mom, we are in... When you come, come harvest all, and then I'll have you clean. But I think he'll finish pie training on this skill, or this practice, this round, whatever you want to call it. Alright, you are 64% done with blocks? Hell yeah! Or with the thinking skill, I shouldn't say it blocks. You have two sets of blocks now. So maybe Ambrose, when he's done, he can go... Well, no, he's not to level 2, I'm thinking yet. So he can't really go uh, play with the blocks. He could practice movement on them, though. So that will be convenient. Don't cry. Don't cry. You will do okay. Tomas is calling. You won't believe it. We... Uh, this person is such a sweetheart. I'm in love. Fantastic. Um, what is this? Just call me Hubert from hooking up another sim. Fantastic. I love the fact we're flirty. Um, is that there's someone to be flirty with because we're already pregnant now, so. You know. How is that crying? You come stack blocks. And get that movement skill up. There we go. Oh, seriously, he didn't get it? You were so close. You're so close. I thought I thought for sure he was going to get it. Dang it. Is she already out? How far is she? She's already outside. I'm going to let her go harvest real quick. And then, uh, and then come here. Go here. You're just wanting to cry. I'm sorry. Go here. Are you done? 
There we go. So we have a little bit of stuff to sell. Um. Oh my god, why are you crying? Just. Uh, <laughs> okay, well, we have $100 worth of harvestables. That's not bad. Um, you are not going to play this. You are neither going to play this. Um, Ambrose, you're going to get some potty help. Get that potty skill up. So you can do it on your own from now on. That's all I care about is just you doing it on your own. How is your skill coming? Oh, you're so close. 93%. All right, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, and 100% complete. We got all our skills up. Say what? This is spoiled, isn't it? Oh, we can eat that. Sweet. So eat that while we wait on your mom to be done potty training and then we will age you up um you're not having fun at all i'm sorry baby i'm sorry how about you go and use the restroom and then to work on your fitness skill and your fun we can where is it work out do a power sculpting video that'll be fun for you Let's see. Are you almost done? Did you reach high school level? Oh, you did reach high school level too. Okay. Well, um. Yeah. I know. I know. You're crying. You're crying. How about you, um, come stack. Um, you come and clean this. Our doctor is calling us. We've been thinking of trying for a baby lately. What do you do? You think we should do it? We want to, but we're not sure. It's a huge responsibility. What do you think? Me, you know me, I'm all about trying for kids, so let's try for that baby. Alright. Um. Okay. Ambrose, you're going to go do that. You're doing that. You're throwing that away. Potter, you're just being the happy little baby you are. Um, how about we get the cake out? Let's see. And, uh, Mom, what are you doing? No, now is not the time to eat. Now is not the time to eat. I know you're hungry. But how about... Uh, I told you no. I told you no. I swear to God, if you take a bite, I'm... I'm reciting you. You don't want to listen. Okay, it's time to age your baby up. So, Potter, just to clarify... All th five traits, level three. Let's, uh... Let's, uh, help out candles, Potter. Fantastic! Now, come on. Look at him doing that, uh, video. Workout video. Alright. So, yeah, I get this picture. Alright. Come on. Perfect. Alright, so we do use the random trait generator that James Turner created to uh, randomize traits for this challenge. So, I will put in that he is a child and then we will generate and see what we get. Oh, he's artistic and a book lover. Okay, that's kind of cute. Uh, I will you to actually select, please. There we go. And bookworm. Do, 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 do. There we go. So, we have that. I love that he's a bookworm. That's adorable. Okay. But, um... Let's go and give him a makeover. He's pretty cute. He has a cute face. But it's time for a makeover. Alright, this is our Mr. Potter. Um, 
up close, of course, I had to give him, since his name is Potter and he's a spellcaster, I had to give him the round Harry Potter glasses. Um, I gave him shaggy hair like Harry Potter has. Um, I think he's real cute. And then his, his uh, clothes, he actually came with this sweater on. And I love it because it has the little moon on it. Uh, which reminds me of, like, wizards and stuff. And it's a vest. And that's what he has to wear at school is, like, a button uh, up vest thing. It normally has a tie, but they don't really have any tie options. So this was close to I was going to get. Try to dress him up similar to what he would go to school in. So this is his every day. Um, his formal uh, didn't have exactly Harry Potter a formal wear attire for kids, but I did choose a red tie for Gryffindor. And here's the sportswear, kind of the same thing, red for Gryffindor. Uh, his sleepwear, his actual sleepwear is like blue striped pajamas up and down stripes. This is the closest we're going to get. It was either that or do the plaid blue pajamas that I do all the time. So I figured I'd mix up a little bit and do this. His party wear, this is a little bit more accurate. It has a flap to it and all that. But again, red for Gryffindor. Same as swimwear, I just went red. Um, here's his hot weather wear. Doesn't look very hot weather wear -y, but I just wanted it to be close to, to what he wore to school. And his cold weather wear. The jacket is kind of inspired by the jacket he wears in the snow scene. Um, the rest of it, I just went black to go with the jacket. So that is our Mr. Potter. Let's get back into gameplay. Alright, here's Mr. Potter. Up close and personal in game. Didn't realize he had the jagged teeth or I would have fixed that, but oh well. Um, we just may have to put him in braces at some point. <laughs> but I have everyone set up to do what they need to do. Um, Mom just put candles on the cake so we can put it back in the fridge. How much long does the cake have? 15 hours. Okay, yeah, we'll have it for a while. Um, Mom, how about we breed frogs and our, uh, should probably sell that. Sell it for 160. Yes, lovely. Um, how about you come use the restroom, take a brush, actually take the shower first and then use the restroom. And I think we should cook, because we are getting hungry. So, let's, um, cook a meal. Let's, um, do veggie sliders. That sounds good. So, we'll do some veggie sliders. You are good. You're getting your skill up. Then, I'll have him do homework later. Right now, he's just going to work on his skill. Although all my sims keep getting this uh, fear of being hurt by someone nearby. That's really annoying. I'm just going to delete these because I, I turned it off, This the fears. He's still sad from a bummer school day. It doesn't have to do with the fear, so I'm not going to uh, delete that. But the fear for the moolets, I think, shouldn't be popping up since I turned off fears altogether. But that's just me. That's just my thought. So he's going to do his homework. Let's see. Um, I wonder what skill he is creative. So maybe, well, he's also a bookworm. So maybe he'd be more into like science experiments. So I don't know. Let's uh, after you do your homework, we'll have you experiment some and get some logic skill up in here. Let's see. The toddler is hungry and getting tired. So, whenever mom is done with making the veggie sliders, we'll get Ambrose to grab one real quick. But until then, he can work on his uh, movement skill, which is almost level two. There we go. Okay. We got that. Let's come grab a serving. We'll work on that movement skill walking all the way over there. 
But you're not hungry, right? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you're not hungry. And you're not hungry. Is Patchy you play? I know Patchy's helping us with homework. How cute. How cute. Alright, let's put the rest of these in the fridge. Um, Ambrose, when you're done, you can go potty. And probably by the time you're done doing all of that, you can, you're going to be exhausted and you need to go to sleep. Don't you wash that dish. Don't you wash that dish. You should know better. We sell that for money. Mom, did you ever finish that book? I don't think you did. Let's see. Where's name's right or zoom right? Who's that baby? We've been trying to write this book for like three or four parts now. Let's just get it done with. Man, this this workout video can go on for a while. Is it just go until I tell it to stop? Because we might not even need the punching bag if that's the case. I feel like his fun's all the way up. Maybe we should just switch to the punching bag so the TV's available for other people. Sure, you can write that time music. Oh, we just got... Potter just got to level two. Alright, bum. You want potty? Let's see. You just enjoying your book up here. How... You barely started. It's seven now. Alright, okay, she's probably going to finish this and then end up going to bed. Um... How fast is this game as fitness? Because I would like him to have his fitness up to level 3 by tomorrow. Or not by tomorrow, but by Friday. So tomorrow will be the last day to work on it. But he does need to do his homework. So he's has fun. He needs to do homework though because he will lose grade performance if he doesn't do his homework. Here's that. Potter, you're going to go get your skill started. Let's see. Oh, I should probably take that tablet back. Thank you very much. You're going to go work on your little brother's bed. Of course, the bed he is going to. It's fine. Let's see. How's this pie skill coming? He is at 36% to level 3. And he has to get level 3. So... Oh, his movement is almost level 2! Exciting! When you're done with your homework, do you think you could clean that? That would be great. Oh, there's a plate. I would never notice if it wasn't sparkling. <laughs> I would have never noticed. Oh, Let's get this picture of him playing with the experimentation station. Whatever you call it. There we go. Love that. Okay. How's his needs? Oh, he is getting tired. But could you at least... Oh, you are to level 2. I was about to say, can you at least get to level 2? We'll maybe get halfway through level 2. And then we'll have just a skill and a half to get it up tomorrow. Um. Let's see. You're... I'm so used to transferring between people and there being so many people and stuff. But, uh, no, there's only four people now. I don't know what to do with myself. Let's see. You need to finish this book. Just wait until you get to 50. Oh, wait. Never mind. You are so tired. Never mind. I was going to have you get 50%, but you are exhausted. So let's um have you take a brush shower, use the restroom, and we'll feed you in the morning. Ambrose, you don't have, or Potter, you don't have a bed yet. Um, is this bed? Uh, so, assigned to Luna. Okay, well, we can assign that to Potter. So, he has his own bed. Stop playing with the thing. I told you to stop playing. Go do that. And then you will sleep. You are asleep. You're still doing homework. Um... After you do homework and clean, I need you to use 
and take a brisk shower and then probably go ahead and go off to bed too just because no one's working on their skill anymore everyone's just keeping care of their needs did you finish that book you didn't finish that book why did you stop writing are you tired you're getting tired Oh, it broke. Boo. Replace. Okay. Well, let's see if we can finish writing that book. Let's see. How much further do we have? Uh, yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to finish that tonight. Alright, so I'm just going to send all the kids and mom to bed and meet you back in the morning. Alright, it's the morning. Everyone is getting some breakfast up in here. Uh, everyone's awake but the toddler. I figure I let the toddler sleep as long as he needed to because we didn't have to really go anywhere today. So I'll be good. Mom, what are you doing? Why are, why are you all walking away from the table? Aw, I'm just going to give each other a little hug. I guess that's nice. Mom, I would like you to cook some more. And I already cooked once this episode, but I, I get paranoid that we're going to have more people than food. So let's just do some grilled cheeses. And then I think I'm going to have you finish that book finally. Because it is annoying me that um, it's not done writing yet. So we're going to write that book so we can publish it. Let's see. I'm going to throw that plate away. Potter, why did you have to do that? Alright, we have less than an hour until they get to school. Potter needs to get to a beast unit. And he does have a level 2. So maybe we can make him work hard and earn that today. And then he's already... Clover's already ready to agent Janae. So he just gotta, has to get that skill when he gets home from uh, school today. So that is the plan, Jan. Alright, you really need to go potty, and I don't want you to use your diapers. So, let's go potty. And then... Mom! No! Don't! Don't leave the food on the stove, are you nuts? Are you nuts? You're already in the middle of writing. Oh no. Go back down there before it starts the fire! And that's broken. Okay, we'll just replace that. We have the money. Oh my god. Please hurry up. I'm begging you. What trimester are you in? You're four hours for your second trimester. Alright, so we'll probably give birth in the next part. So I'm assuming... Hey. Text emergency. I texted someone, but they didn't text back. It's been like an hour. Should I text them again? Yeah, maybe this first one. No wait for them or respond. Text a mutual friend and have them poke. I would just wait for them to respond. Alright, please do not walk away from the stove again. What are you doing? You're just dancing. Well, you gotta go to school, so let's turn that off. Use your shovel to his motor skill. I would like you to get in your mental skill, but okay. Uh, we're gonna send them alone. I think... This is po Potter's first day of school, so I will get the picture of him coming through the door. Did I already fix this? Wait, no. I, I thought I fixed this. He keeps getting this blue light, but I don't know why. Hold on. We have to... No. Cleared sentiments there. Focus the camera. Or, uh, open sense profile. No negative sentiments there. Is it Ambrose? No. Ah. Uh, it's Potter. Okay, I'm deleting that just because it's real annoying. We're just going to remove those because he keeps getting sad and it's uncontrollable and it's really annoying. Okay, come on, come to school. Let's see. We don't have to have Clover work hard. But Potter does need to work hard. See if we can get that grade up. 
Let's see. Let's get a picture of him coming through the door for his first day of school. Dresses, little moon sweater. So adorable. I'm pretty sure that was for werewolves. But I think it's cute enough. Alright. So Potter's off to school. And we are going to have him study hard. He was like 20 minutes late, but it's fine. What are you doing? Wait, you finished your food? Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's go ahead and um, I would like you to resume writing. Who's that baby? I, I think we're just like not meant to finish it. <laughs> Honestly. Okay, what are you doing? Stop. What do you need? Food. We can arrange that. Open. Let's get some vegetable sliders up in here. Come on, take a, take a slice. There we go. And uh, how about when you're done, let's um change outfit. We'll change your everyday wear. And then we'll work on movement and potty. So I think he already went potty. Yeah, he already went potty. So we need to work on movement after we we uh eat and change clothes. So we're going to wander and get that movement skill up. And we could probably work on thinking. Because I always fall behind with thinking, so that'd be a good one to work on. Let's see. You're fat you're putting that plate on the table, aren't you? Yep, that's exactly what you're doing. Alright, throw that away. Why do you have to go all the way back in here to change your clothes? I don't understand. But oh well. Maybe I'm not meant to. Alright. We got the movement skill level 2. Fantastic. Um, Miss Bubble. Another standardized test. Power is almost done. When he rises, he skipped a bubble near the top. All his answers are one off. He starts to tell the teacher he realizes he'll have to take it all over again. It's really only for the state. Does it it doesn't affect his grade. And eh, let's confess the mistake. Just as Power feared, the teacher scolds him for his carelessness and makes him come back come back and retake come back at recess and take the test again. Angry Par feels in pretty power, not even looking at the questions. Damn. Well, that sucks. Uh, okay, this one says, counter bullying. Uh, now that Clover's getting pretty good grades, some bullies have been picking on him lately. Should he confront them with a way to come back or ignore them and just hope they go pick a different ta target? Um, I think he would confront them. I don't know what shoes that one, so... The bullies respond to, well, crafted arguments. They wouldn't be bullies. They understand that they are being insulted, but they don't quite understand how, and that just makes them matter. That's funny. Okay. <laughs> Alright. You're wondering, how about you come work on your imagination oh, when you're done wondering? You know, it says it's 100, 160%. Okay, maybe we should, uh... Yeah, there you go. Now it says level 2. Let's come play with dolls. Get that imagination skill up a little bit. Oh, I thought he was going to work on thinking, didn't I? Mm, okay, well, he's going to work on imagination now. Because <laughs> I already set it up, so. Let's see. Did you finish your book? We just got book royalties. Did you finish your book? You did finish your book. Fantastic. Come publish your book. First, get the mail, and then we are going to sell to a publisher, and we should have some more stuff to sell. Let's breed frogs right quick. Uh, extra hundred dollars. No, I don't want a university. Let's see. Ambrose, you're playing with dolls. All right. All right. What did we get from the mail? We got some toys. $85 and $100. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Now what are you going to do? You could come work on 
skills with your toddler. I guess that'd be cute. So let's um maybe do some flashcards. Let's uh flashcards teach basic needs. Yeah, let's get that thinking skill to level two so he can play on the blocks. Alright. Come on, fast forward this. Where are you oh you're gonna play right there. Okay. Oh, I, oh, okay. Um, okay, Caleb, just because I don't know if I'm going to need you here or not, I will say yes to being your best friend. And, uh, we're no longer best friends with our doctor. Okay, I was trying to do flashcards with my toddler, and you kind of came in and just started playing toys. I know it's your kid. But that's really annoying. I would like you to go home. Let's, um, well, actually, she needs to calm down and I said she needs to pee, but she doesn't actually have to pee. Okay. You can come pee anyways. And then maybe, how do I, how do I calm down? Take a thoughtful shower, maybe? Or can I just say in the mirror, try to calm down? Oh, try to calm down. There we go. Alright, while you play the baby, Caleb, since you're interrupting me from working on his basic needs and just playing dolls with him, uh, I guess I'll go try to calm down a little bit because I'm very playful and I don't like that. This is kind of cute, father-son moment. We don't get many of these moments. Um... I love that she's using the sink next to where she is. This happened twice now in the same episode. It's pretty impressive. Pretty impressive. Ambrose. How about you play with dolls? Just since my um is busy now. Okay, she calmed herself down. She calmed herself down. Okay, so let's um... Caleb, how about you just go ahead and go on home? It was cute and all, but um, I think you should go. And then we are going to try once again to teach basic needs. Um, stop playing with the dolls. Alright, there we go. Let's try this again. And she is in her second trimester, 23 hours from being in her third trimester. I think I sit on the couch and do it. I haven't seen them use this couch or stuff to eat on yet. Are they going to get on the floor? They're going to get on the floor. Okay. Well, at least they went to the same spot. Let's, uh... I want to see a picture of her holding up a car. It's a tree! I don't think Ambrose has ever been... Oh, no, it's broccoli. <laughs> Well, that's kind of a tree. That's kind of a tree. Uh, toothbrush. Okay, cool. Alright, but the kids should be home in the next couple hours. Let's see, Clover is ready to age up. He needs to get the skill up. And we are almost to a B student. We're so close to that level 3. Our, our final level. Alright. They say they can't reach our mailbox, but I know it works. So, I guess when you're done to your basic needs, we can get the mail. Shouldn't be bills, but we are prepared for bills if we have them. Because we have, like, 12 grand right now. Which is pretty decent, especially for a house this size. Pretty decent. Alright. He reached level 2 in thinking. Is his attention all the way up? Because I'm mainly doing this gets attention up. Yeah, he's done that. So how about you come and go potty? Alex, go get the mail. And then use the restroom. And come. Uh, more choices. Get leftovers. Get a nice salad. He needs to go to the restroom. And then... Let's see. What 
skill need. Your all, your movement is, and your pie are closest to level three. But why don't we get that imagination skill up to level two? Maybe we have some tablet time. We don't really use the tablet that much anymore. So we could draw with the llama a couple times. That'd be great. Um, okay, let's fast forward this because the kids should be coming home soon. And hopefully, uh, Potter will have his grade up. Let's check that. Oh yeah, he's going to get his grade up. Fantastic. What did she have in her inventory? Two more toys. That was $155. Jeez. Hey, yep. Grades are up. Um, you are having a mood swing. Great! <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, how about you come use the restroom, come grab some food, and then after that you can come do a workout video. Let's do a dance video this time. Does that get the dance video get the fitness skill or the fitness or the dancing skill? Okay, I'm just gonna do power sculpting video just in case I don't want to get the wrong skill. Uh, after he gets the skill, he can do his homework. He needs to have fun before he can do his homework. Potter, you are great. Um, how about you go ahead and uh camera angles in this game sometimes let's get leftovers you want some fried fish that works with me and we are going to use um take let's take a brush shower yeah let's see I don't because he was his skill in um, mental. I don't know if he has fun when doing this. I hope he does because he's about to have to do, do it more. Um, your skill is a level 2 so we need to get up 2 more levels before tomorrow. So I sincerely hope we can do that. Maybe we can skip the shower. That's not such a big deal. Stop cleaning that up. Wait, did you have to go to the bathroom? I told you to go to the bathroom. I cl I canceled the shower, not the, t the toilet. Okay, yeah, he used the toilet. He's having fun. Oh, he skipped eating, though. I guess, I guess after he gets level 3, we'll let him eat. He is 29% to level 3. Alright. But he is having fun, so this is important. Okay, you, you did that. Let's come over here and experiment. Get that skill up. So you can be a teenager. Alex, what are you doing? How about you come in? What's wrong with that trash can? Oh, there it is. Okay, clean that and mop it. You were eating. I'm assuming that's what you were eating. So. You can clean that and then go back to eating that because I want your hunger to be full. Um, how is the garden? Is there anything ready to har Oh, we do have some harvest holes. Yes. Okay, harvest all. After we mop. You, where are you on your skill? 39% complete. Have a long way to go, buddy. But you're getting there. Imagination skill level two. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, the only one we don't have to level two yet is communication. So mom is busy. So I guess you'll have to work on your tablet again. So let's watch or do videos. Watch videos so we can get the communication skill up. If we could get to at least everything to level 2 this episode, that would be ideal. Like, really ideal. Alright, so you're working on that. Working on that. Alright. Why did you I 
I guess you are hungry. But I need you to work on fitness. You're not... But yeah, you're not... Sore or anything. So maybe... I don't know what should be faster. The videos or... The punching bag. I get a feeling the punching bag might be a little bit... Um, quicker. So, um... Maybe we can... Practice punching. And then... Uh, I just want to listen to loud music. There we go. I may, I may need it to choose that before I choose practice punching. You're still eating, bud. You never stop you. Oh, you're full. So, I guess that's fine. Now let's practice punching while we listen to music. Come on. Stop sitting. And see if we can... I thought you could listen to music and work out at the same time. Was I? Am I crazy? Let's uh push the limits and listen to loud music. Could you not listen to music beforehand? I guess not. Okay. Well, we are going to practice the punching. Um, I don't know if you want. Fun with this. Oh, he is getting fun. Okay, cool. Let's see, and we have forty four percent complete. Let's just finish that before you go to sleep, bud. Mom, you're kinda of bothering us. We're trying to get our mental skill up. We have two skills to get up, so I'd rather you leave him alone. Check your need to use the restroom. And maybe Ambrose, what are you working on? Communication? Yeah, how about instead of working on your tablet, let's make funny faces. Um, we should be able to teach to talk. Somehow, teach to talk. There we go. And that gets up communication skill. Just gotta make sure he doesn't choose to do anything. Else. Okay. You're not going to walk all the way to the kids' bathroom to go wash your hands. Alright. Someone left food out, but it's fine. It's money. Alright. Let's teach you to talk. Get that communication skill up. Let's see. How is your fitness coming? Not very well, but it is getting up. It's already at 57%. And he's already stinky. <laughs> Oh, Joy. He's doing such weak punches. Like, he's trying, but they're just so weak. So, he's trying, and that's all that matters. That is all that matters. Oh, he's tired. Yeah, it is 7.30. And he's hungry. Oh, yeah, okay. Alright, no. Go potty. And then we will... Open. There's gotta be something to want. Come on. Everyone's been eating the salads and there's not only one left. I guess we'll get some food. Let's uh, grab a serving. Actually, your hunger is worse than your pie, so why don't you go ahead and grab a serving and then you can go potty. Let's see. So, far, so much for getting all your skills level 2. Ah, that's so annoying. That's so annoying. Mom, you <laughs> went ahead and went to sleep. Alright, how about instead you um come take a shower and then come and grab some leftovers and then you'll probably be good to go to sleep. Actually, you'll probably need to go use the restroom before you go to sleep. But that's just out of caution. Hey, you are done with your food. Fantastic. I, I should put a table in here just for them to put the plates on. Because they keep having to do that. Oh my god, what? Oh, 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 hey. Okay. You started a fire. You started a fire. Let's, uh, mom, can you put the fire out, please? Extinguish. Put the fire out, extinguish, please. 
Potters discover fire. Yes, I see that. And everyone's going to freak out and stop what they're doing. Oh, my God. I thought it was The Sims 3 where this blew up. Uh, well, I guess our carpet's burnt. Lovely. How? Where's your skill? Where's your skill? You are just level 2. I need you to be level 4. You haven't even done your homework. Okay, well... Do your homework. Take a break from this and do your homework. Let's see. Um, you, you were trying to go potty. Uh, the fire had to interrupt everything. Go to sleep. But tomorrow's Friday, so this is their last chance to grade up. So... I even if it pushes them, I think they should. Um, oh, you smelly. Why, why, the toddler, toddler, didn't I tell you to go potty? Yeah, you're going. Stop interrupting him. Let's see, where's your fitness? Go you are so close. You are 73%. I know you are smelly. I know you are probably tired. But if you could just come here and practice punching a few more times, I bet you can get that fitness skill up and then age up and move out tomorrow. Let's see. You can come take a shower after you finish your skill and then do, do your homework. You're taking a break, you're doing that. And you're hungry. Why are you not eating? How about you? I always skip it. You get leftovers. Come on. We're having a late night tonight, you guys. I normally get them in bed by 10 o'clock. But tonight may be a bit later at night. We're getting some grilled cheese. Um, let's see. Let's do an experiment. Hopefully it doesn't sound fire again. I just really want him to age up t tomorrow in the next episode. I need to, to do that. Stop trying to wash your dish. Hey, um, how about you come... Come use the ranch room and then you can go ahead and go to sleep. You are going to bed. You need to work on the mental skill. After you do your homework, you did you get your skill up? You're so close. 68 82%. Why did you cancel and go take a shower? I know you're smelly, but you, you really need to take a shower after you practice punching. Um, you know, this episode has been pretty long. I think I'm just going to get his skill up. And then I might have to work on Potter's off camera, which I normally don't do in this series. But it's like 1030 at night. <laughs> you probably don't want to watch him stay up all night to get to middle skill level 4. When he is only 99% to level 3. He's going to go work on that now. So let's let's watch him do the fitness skill. Mental skills level 3. Fantastic. Come on. Let's get that skill to 100%. 93%. 94%. 95%. 96%. 97%. 98%. 98%, 98 99% and your fitness skill level 3 hey so all you have left is do your homework and then after he does his homework I'm going to keep care of his needs a good bed honestly so I'm going to get his skill up to level 4 he may be tired in the morning but um it'll be worth it to get him to grade up so that is it for this episode you guys thanks so much for watching make sure to like subscribe and do all that awesome stuff because you guys Awesome people. I'll see you next time. All right.